came out to play every day. And so did the princesses. They were on vacation from their princess duties and were having the time of their lives at a quiet little cottage on Mirror Lake. Oh, I love swimming. Me too, obviously. <laughs> mm, I wouldn't mind a bit more adventure. I know where we can find some adventure. Really? What do you suggest? I've been reading about a certain haunted lake house. And it's only ten minutes away from here. Uh, uh, haunted? Oh, I'm sure you're not afraid of a harmless ghost or two. Or you, Princess Aurora? Hmm. I wouldn't say ghosts are harmless. Don't worry. It's going to be fun. We can follow the directions in my book to find the house. Then we can explore it for a while and come back before sunset. That sounds exciting. We'll have to take a boat. I'll come along too. The princesses took a small boat and set off for the haunted lake house. Aria swam alongside them. Soon, they saw an abandoned, broken down cottage in the distance. to be eat. I don't know if this is a good idea. We haven't bought any supplies. Not even a flashlight or water or Oh, stop worrying, Aurora. Try to relax and have some fun. Inside, the lake house looked as though it had not been lived in for many, many years. The furniture was practically buried in dust, and most of the cobweb-covered glass windows were shattered. The glass floor was covered in grime and tiny rat footprints. Ew! It smells like rotten cheese! And it looks like there are some rats in here eating the cheese. <laughs> Look! An old game of Scrabble on the table. a good idea. This lake house is definitely haunted. Put that scrabble letter back where you found it, Rapunzel. I already did, but the pieces are... <gasps> They're moving themselves! Let's get out of here! I can't! The door is locked! Aria is still outside! Maybe she can't help us! Aria! 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 It's no use! She's not here! Wait! Someone's coming! Mermaids! Maybe they can't help us! Oh, 
<gasps> but those aren't mermaids from Aria's kingdom. <laughs> we need to find a way to leave before these mermaids break the floor. <laughs> what if we write back to the spirit? Sorry, princesses. I didn't realize that the lake house was going to be so dangerous. I'm sorry, too. I would give anything to just be sitting back on the beach again. Now! Next time, I won't let my curiosity get the best of me. The important thing is that we're all safe again. Thank you for saving me, Aria. That's what friends are for. I'm so glad to be out of there, but I still can't help but wonder who or what was moving those scramble places. Well, according to my book, a fisherman once lived in that house with his wife and two children. Maybe they were the ones who helped us. So, that house isn't exactly haunted. The evil mermaids use it to trap people. And it seems like the fisherman's spirit wants to help people escape. That's an excellent explanation. We should warn the villagers about it. When they returned to their lakeside cottage, the princesses decided to hire workers to build a sign near the lake house to warn people about the evil mermaids. But Princess Bella often thought about going back someday, just to play Scrabble with the mysterious 